The mattress war has claimed a casualty. Houston-based mattress firm has now filed for bankruptcy. The company not only a big mattress retailer here, but nationwide. Channel 2's Roseanne Aragon is live with how this is going to impact Houston stores. Roseanne. That's right. This company is looking to overcome more than a billion dollars in liabilities, and that means making some cuts. The nation's largest mattress retailer now scaling back. It seemed like they had too many stores everywhere, so they had to right size at some point. The company now closing 200 stores around the country in a matter of days. The CEO stating, leading up to the holiday shopping season, we will exit up to 700 stores in certain markets where we have too many locations in close proximity to each other. Consumers here weren't shocked. It makes sense that it's closing. Especially now with people are actually starting to buy their mattresses. Court documents showed the first 200 stores. In Texas, 35 locations are expected to close, 16 of which are in Greater Houston. Half of those are in the city of Houston. Others are in Katy, Pearland, Missouri City, Sugarland, Conroe, and Richmond. The bankruptcy option gives them some opportunities. While it's not a perfect solution. Barbara Stewart is a professor of retailing and consumer sciences at the U of H. She says the leading retailer will likely come up from this. Probably with a few less stores, but also emerge well. A delight for those loyal to the brand. Really great in customer service, really compatible prices. The overall experience was great. Now, the store behind me here in Southwest Houston is making the cut, but for a full list of the first stores that are expected to close, you can head to our website, clicktohouston.com. Reporting live in Southwest Houston, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News.